It's a problem for fire stations around the region. Not enough money to retain and attract firefighters. And that's a problem that the city of Bardstown is trying to fix. Firefighters are hard to get anymore. We're losing people to, uh, for higher paying jobs in Jefferson County or Lexington. At small city departments like Bardstown Fire, pay and retention are slipping through the cracks. The 18 person staff starts around $15 an hour. Wages the department and the city are working to raise. This pay raise for the firefighters right now was hoping to slow down the bleed a little bit. The city's general fund is split between fire, EMS, police and recreation. The proposed budget would help tackle the fire department's issue with a one-time pay increase to take effect beginning at the start of the fiscal year. The budget would give the department almost $90,000 to help raise pay. I have a lot that are, they grew up in Nelson County, they're dedicated to Nelson County, but in the same turn, these guys need to be paid for putting their life on the line. Chief Billy Mattingly says momentarily it's enough to keep guys around, but that if the city can't find a way to continue with pay raises, Retention and recruiting could get worse. Now we have a house fire here. I might have six, if I'm lucky, eight people on the scene where Jefferson County has a house fire. They could have up to 30, 40 people on the scene. So it's a big difference. The department and city say the work for competitive pay can't stop at this alone. Uh, the guys, they work hard and they're putting their lives on the line. Um, the city's aware of it and we're, we're working to do the best we can to get them what they need. The city of Bardstown is considering a study that would help increase the pay of city employees across the board. In Bardstown, Dalton Godby, WDRB News.